push, stand, move. There's some action going on in the back. Boom, punch, punch, gut shot. Boom. The scene they're working on today is a complicated fight sequence where Colin fends off a handful of bad guys, but ultimately takes a bullet and falls to his death. With this many people and fists and feet flying, it takes plenty of rehearsal time before they run through it at full speed. Roundhouse, duck, hook, spinning. When we're doing a fight scene, everything has to be precisely coordinated so that everybody knows when they're coming in, which weapons they're coming in on, and for safety reasons. Everybody has to be clear and just clear of each other's feet. This Punahou graduate is an expert in karate, kung fu, taekwondo, and hapkido. And he says his martial arts experience and varied list of interests not only have helped him in being a stuntman for the past 12 years, but make this the perfect job as well. And John's coming back this way. For me to be excited about life, I have to be constantly doing different things. I enjoy playing piano, surfing, golf, martial arts. And when I got into stunts, I mean, it was all in one bag, you know? You come here, work for a day, and get paid for it. It's great. And action. What's going on? Hey. If this were a real movie, this scene would cost $10,000 to produce. Today, money isn't a factor, but that doesn't mean that the risk factor is any lower. The dangers involved in stunts are very real. If one doesn't practice, or if one's a little late on his timing, you could get hurt or worse. And you've seen that in many other pictures over the last few years as we're getting into more and more dangerous stunts. The scene is capped off with a showdown on the roof. In a high fall, no one but an experienced stuntman could endure. With this and many other stunts on tape, Hollywood's decision makers will have a better idea of what Hawaii's professionals can deliver. In turn, Colin and his stable of stunt guys will hopefully get more opportunities for fights and falls that pay off in cash rather than just in bruises. Yeah. Union scale for stunt work about 500 bucks a day and a special stunt, one that takes a lot of training and setup, can earn somebody $5,000. Now, for all the chills and thrills and spills involved with stunt work, I don't think I've ever met a group that, as a whole, was more conscious of safety. These folks want to remind you that always learn stunt work from a pro and never try it at home. Right now, we're going to try to make you a winner with the Hawaiian host sweepstakes. Your chance to be a Hawaiian host, bring some folks over from another island, or use those round-trip tickets on Aloha Airlines all by yourself. You just send us a postcard, name, address, and phone number to this address, Hawaiian Host.